I, in my opinion, think this has got to be one of the weakest waves of color changers that Mattel has ever done. No, seriously, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. It's seriously gotten weaker and weaker. As, um... We've gotten variants of color changers, but not like actual new color changers, like character color changers that are new, in a sense. Which is kind of annoying. Whereas today is no exception for the color changers line. As today, we'll take a look at the some of the two newest color changers that they've released. I don't know when this video will come out. So, today we're going to take a look at the new color changers that Mattel has done in the recent months. Like, March was when they did them. Found Revo at a store, missed out on Doc, so I had to order them online, which was crazy expensive. But it was worth it totally worth it so i don't know if this case will be re-released or not as a matter of fact i found revo today at walmart the damn recording this whereas doc is impossible to find so if you see doc hanging around on the pegs grab him by no means or by all means my mistake so here's revo costs He's got the light blue and the dark blue for his card art. Two and one, Revo Cause. They did another variation of Revo Cause, as you can see back there, not too long ago. So if you'd like to see that review along with the Dash Jam and Color Changer, you can definitely check that one out. Color Changers. Yeah, I did that video like two years ago. Revo Cause, along with the Hudson Hornet one. On the back there, it says Revo Cause, Color Changers. I've heard these haven't been scanning well at Target. But I don't know why these are being found at Walmart, though. Or, they were. Icy Water changes the color, Warm Water changes it back. How nice. But except it's the other way around, you see. I mean, mm, the Color Changer is okay, to say the least. I was pretty excited when I got it, but now that I look at it closer, meh. So here's the Hudson Hornet. The one I've been clamoring for. The fabulous Hudson Hornet. Fabuloso Fabulux Hudson Hornet. Two in one. As you can see, it goes from like a golden yellow to a dark blue color. Back here, fabulous Hudson Hornet. Dark. In the light color, icy water, warm water, whatnot. Oh, okay. All right. Without further ado, let's get these guys on out of here. I'm not really complaining that we've got new color changers, but I just want to see new, more new characters. You know. That's what I really want to see. You know. More new character color changers. That does not look good at all. Nuh-uh. But oh well. Now is the Hudson Hornet's turn. I've done a lot of color changers videos recently. All right, there he is on out. So, yep, so, I'm gonna show them off as they are in their normal state, as they are in their stages right now. Here's Revo Koss. The front looks more glossier. Compared to the previous version, 115 on the sides right there, J12071, don't know what kind of code that is, MCL, 
115, the serial code again, 115 on the top, his engine exhaust, got stickers for the eyes, oh, 2021 Mattel, 3453SD, 345th day of 2023, made in Vietnam, here he is compared to the previous one that was released. I definitely prefer this one, but this version is okay, to say the least. 115, 115, yeah. I would have preferred maybe like Gearston Marshall to be a color changer. Like, come on, you had to do Revo again? Like, um, why not do Gearston Marshall? Why not do Gearston Marshall? Yeah. Whereas the fabulous Hudson Hornet, not really much. Ugh. The yellow's kind of bleeding through. This one's kind of a washed out blue. Whereas this is much darker. You can tell which one is which. Uh, and, so, and it's already changing. Oh, my God. The decals look just about the same, though. Fifty one Hudson Hornet. It's already changing. Oh, my God. Here's the base, 3453SD, 345th day of 2023, made in Vietnam. Oh gosh, this guy is really changing. I'll have to get some water for the little bends, so I'll do that really quick. Okay, so we're back, and we're going to test out these color changers. So, we got hot water right here and cold water right here with some ice in it. So, first things first is that we're going to dip the color changers in the warm water and see how they change. And of course, I got my other versions of those color changers here. So, why not? We're going to do Revo Cause first, based off of the Pixar employee Ivo Cause. Going to see how this changes. You know, it's not really a hot commodity. Or at least I would think compared to the Hudson Hornet color changer. But, you know, this does the job. Let's see how this one changes. Ooh, so a bit of a brighter blue, so to say. Yep, a bit of a brighter blue. So, here they are with each other. Mm, they're not really different. Well, I suppose they are because the coloring difference right there. Yeah. Set Rebo Cause aside. Now we're going to do the Hudson Hornet. There he is in all his glory. Let's see how he changes. Oh my god, that is a sick ass color change. You go, Doc. Woo! Whereas the card art showed that he changed from like a golden yellow this is more like a pus yellow kind of disgusting i know i'm probably gonna get demonetized for that aren't i but this works out just fine in my opinion hornet the back right there 51 fabulous sets and hornet so this is actually the pretty cool one out of the bunch to be honest change the other one yeah a yellow fabulous hudson hornet that's pretty epic probably gonna have to test out these color changers even more yeah you know it's pretty cool that we got more color changers but i'm not really impressed with how like um what's it called um that we're getting variants of characters we already have to different shifts you know 
not just any new characters, which kind of sucks, I know. But, um, but it works for me, to be honest, as I don't already have them in different shifts. So which one is your favorite out of the wave? Revo Koss or Hudson Hornet? I'm going to have to go with the fabulous Hudson Hornet because of that yellow color. I mean, that just looks sick. This weird yellow color. All right. So I think that is going to be pretty much it for this video, guys. I know it was kind of short, but yeah, color changer videos are short, you know? They're a pretty cool item out there, and I recommend getting these. If you still want them, that is. So yeah, pretty cool, these color changers. So I will see you guys on the next video, which I don't know what it'll be. Hopefully something good. So I'll see you guys then. Hold on, Doc. Let me change you back. Here we go. So as always, goodbye. Thanks for watching. And as always, peace.